I don't know the origin of sacred geometry as compared to just geometry. However, there was a book, the use of geometry there was endemic to the whole system, to the sacred geometry of the Gothic cathedrals. And so he explored the geometric basis for the design of the great cathedrals. He also showed that the same system was involved, for example, the Romans were using it, the Greeks were using some aspect of the same system. It's grown incredibly since then. The advent of the internet has certainly brought a lot of attention to the subject. It provides a method of communication that transcends cultural differences, language differences, because it doesn't matter who you are, what your background is, what your religious beliefs are, whether you're profoundly spiritual, whether you're atheists, doesn't matter. The relationship of the diagonal to a square, to its side, is the same. Universally, it's always the same, right? So what it is, is geometry provides not only a methodology, but a language that can transcend the ethnic and cultural and religious differences and so on.